Earlier today, BAE Systems, Boeing, and General Dynamics all unveiling the new engine that you're seeing here. It will eventually find its way into battle. The Army says the engine will cut down on explosive fuel as cargo. It also may even save lives because the enemy won't hear the battery-powered engine running. This is a hybrid engine undergoing its first public test at Santa Clara Defense Contractor BAE Systems. The engine is in this beige-colored metal case, which resembles the front of an armored vehicle. It'll eventually be placed in a chassis like this one, which can become any one of eight combat vehicles. This milestone represents the first time real FCS hardware is integrated into a full electric hybrid power system. This is not, ladies and gentlemen, a fad that started this year or last year. The next generation land combat vehicle is going to be hybrid. You can run on batteries in a quiet scenario and you don't hear, you don't see an exhaust, you don't hear an engine. The only purpose for an engine now is to provide electricity for the batteries. How do I power all the systems soldiers want today that every one of them are electrical? And, and that's one of the other major advantages that hybrid's going to give us. Or what if I want the vehicle to go faster? Uh, we have the absolute best talent in the defense sector working on this program. Let's start that engine.